Good morning, y'all. It's day 29 on the PCT. Uh, first of all, Ryan and Shelly from Arizona, thank you for using the Buy Me a Coffee button to provide me with some virtual trail magic. Uh, I really appreciate you guys. Good to hear from y'all, too. Um, slept pretty good last night. It was just about the right temperature. Um, so today we're gonna try to do like 17 and a half miles today um, and about five of them are in the snow starting about a mile after camp so that should be fun um, I was going to do frosted honey buns again for breakfast but then I, I found these um, for 55 cents and they are 500 calories um, um, I don't know how well they'll travel, but I may have to end up eating them with a spoon out of the package later down the road. <laughs> um, but anyway, let's see what the day brings us. Beautiful view to start the day, so that makes me hopeful. Well, that snow did not freeze up last night. Pretty soft this morning. Makes for some slidey hiking. Well, I think that was the snow for uh, now until we get up around Wrightwood. Um, five days, six days from now. Um, if I don't use my spikes and axe before I get to Agua Dulce and send them home, I'm going to be kind of hurt. Uh, better to use them and not, or better to have them and not need them, I guess, but they are heavy. Definitely some more interesting terrain today. Uh, not bored at all so far. Uh, there are you, Scenic. Kind of neat little uh, camp. It's got a corral and a picnic table. Very cool. This is Holcomb Creek at mile 286. Very nice water source. Uh, next one's six miles out, so I'm gonna carry two liters away from here. I think it's time for a quick geocaching break. And I just know it's gonna be up on top of that rock. Yeah. Well, I was right, but at least it was a fairly quick find once I managed to get my old ass up here. Ah, uh, nice spot for a break. I wonder what's for lunch today. Mm, let's see. Oh, huh, looks like peanut butter and Fritos. What a surprise. Well, I think that's about it for the pines for a while. Uh, back to, uh, High desert scrub and junipers. Ooh, pretty warm down here. The uh, snow looks real refreshing up there though, doesn't it? Uh, onward and downward through the desert we go. Ah, it's gotten very deserty on the trail here recently. Very much like home. Uh, not sure I approve here. Kind of like in the in the pines. It's a fun little section here, but it just keeps teasing me with the sound of the river without ever actually getting me down there. Finally made it down to the water. First thing I did was walk into the stream with my shoes on. Oh, I felt so good. Well, that was just a little tributary to what I'd been hearing for the last hour. That's a mighty fine stream. Ooh, I sat on a log with my feet in the river until they turned completely numb. And right now, that's a good thing. Kind of gave me a scare, laying right across the trail. Uh, 
don't see a rattle though, so I'm not sure what the hell he is. Well, here's my campsite for the night. I wanted to go a little bit further today, but um, this was a nice spot. It had really strong internet um, and only about a half mile short of my goal, so close enough. That's two nights in a row where I've been in a location where I could actually use a bear hang. Well, that's it for day 29 on the PCT. Uh, pretty enjoyable day altogether. I, you know, started high up in the pines, worked my way through some snow slopes that weren't that bad, really, um, and then dropped, dropped most of the day. Um, got some really hot sections. Um, you know, some beautiful desert rocks, though. Um, finally dropped down and uh, made some pretty decent uh, creek crossings, like thigh deep. I mean, and felt pretty good. Um, most of the people I was camped with last night stopped about two miles back. Uh, I wanted to push on a little farther, so solo camping tonight. Um, tomorrow deep creep hot springs so that should be interesting on a saturday um, well anyway thanks for watching uh, if you enjoyed it maybe give it a like or a subscribe thanks